Hey Sagittarius, this is your soulmate reading. We're going to find out uh, through this general read what's going to happen and uh, take however this resonates and leave what does not resonate for more personals. I am on WhatsApp, Instagram, my email, also do I pyramid spells and we have manifestation crystals. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, I Enigma. And let's start. This is Enigma. I'm going to do your soulmate read. Sag, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs in Sagittarius. Let's see the messages for you. The Sun is also a message for a potential soulmate. Marriage. Okay. Ace of Wands. The Nine of Cups. You're about to meet the one. Whoa, this is like the best spread. Okay, this is the best collection of four cards okay best spread of four cards so definitely you have new beginning coming in it's full of love it's full of happiness and it's a hundred percent new beginning it's not like it may happen for some of you it may not happen for some of you it is going to happen for each and every one of you it's a new beginning you're feeling highly passionate about uh, finding your soulmate or being in love with your soulmate. I feel some of you have found the one and you're really happy and this is only going to grow. I feel you guys are going to be the best match and you guys may also build the whole empire together because I'm seeing you guys are full of life, passion, excitement. You guys both are ambitious and I feel like you both are coming through the positive mindset and the two aces with the nine of cups and the sun is a hundred percent sure shot of a beautiful union a soulmate union so this is a confirmation right of the beginning that you're about to meet your soulmate with whom your whole life is changing you're going to be so happy there's a lot of positivity there's a lot of excitement happiness and i feel this emotional growth there's emotional abundance you guys are I feel like there's a lot of attraction, there's strong intimacy and at the same time there's love. It's like it's just growing and growing. For some of you, you may have kids first and then get married if it allows, if this tradition is allowed in your culture, then that is also some something I'm seeing. So you guys are very happy because you may have met the one already. Universe is hearing you. And then we have this Nine of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles. One more, please. Knight of Cups. So definitely someone is coming towards you with a love offer. I'm seeing that you're right now uh, taking slow steps towards your personal growth in your career. Some of you are too busy traveling and your work involves a lot of traveling and it's worth it. You're feeling really happy and recognized. I feel you're well appreciated. For some of you, I feel like Sagittarius, you're more about your personal happiness rather than how you want to convince others to uh, impress them. You are more about your own comfort and peace of mind. I feel like the money is growing. So that makes you feel really, really happy and satisfied and complete within you. It's not like you're worried about what's going to happen in future. How's my money going to be like? Or what should I do to to grow it's like you found your place in 2023 i'm definitely finding you finding the best job for yourself a best life focus for yourself if it's not happened yet it's happening really really soon because your focus is on you more than anybody else and you're also keeping patience because the universe wants you to relax and enjoy and it will bless you with what you deserve the energy right now about you, Sagittarius, is you have options. Maybe there's an uh, an opportunity you may have to relocate or you have some job-related opportunity coming in. And you're right now in this energy of making a decision. You're thinking of long term, like how it's going to benefit you in the long term, how things are going to turn around in the long term. So you're more about that, Sagittarius. You're like, planning about what do you need to do like how things should evolve in the long term so based on that there's a major decision regarding your career that's gonna like uh end up booming in your future i'm seeing the outcome is like your 
career is just naturally booming. I think you just keep on moving your pace because you're right now in this decision making thing and you're taking slow steps because you're cautious, because you're uh, you're thinking things on a long term, um, you know, based on a long term output, long term benefit. What is going to give you a long term benefit based on that is what you're making a decision. Ultimately, you'll reach a point where your career will definitely boom. I'm seeing that happening in 2023 if it hasn't happened yet. For most of you, it's already happened. When this is where your focus will lie, you have someone really fallen in love coming towards you with an offer. Everybody deserves to have a soulmate. So do you. So Sagittarius, don't doubt it because this is a time for you to just literally enjoy and be in love with every moment of your life because every experience will count. Okay, everything that's going to happen in your life is naturally going to count for you. You will remember 2023 for the rest of your life. That's something that I'm strongly sensing from the universe up there. Let's see, Sagittarius, what else do we have here? Based on the major arcana, I feel your person could be Leo somewhere in their charts. Eight of Swords, the Four of Pentacles the okay some of you are literally worried about how do you deal with the money because it's more like when you make money you don't know how to maintain it or how to invest it okay or you're just worried about what is going to pay you more so if it's about money that you're very disturbed or you know confused or trapped about you're being overly thinking leave it on the universe because things will definitely work out somehow there is light okay you will find that opportunity where you know how to how to maintain the income or how to take care of your finances it's all going to happen because right now you might be confused about your financial investments or something that's related to finances so Take one step at a time. Don't like try to jump all right into one thing, which you're already doing. I feel like don't feel trapped. Don't feel, uh, you know, uh, uh, bounded. You have a lot of potential and that potential is going to come out in 2020, 2023 and you will have a lot of opportunities. I was about to say 2024. For some of you, if it's taking a little too long, you can expect this to happen in 2024 because whatever is your current experience is going to lead you to the financial boom. So in the end of the day, you're the winner. So how does it matter right now what's, what's happening in your life? Okay, take it easy. Then we have Saj. Knight of Pentacles, okay, Nine of Swords, Three of Wands. You guys are too busy with your work, Saj. I know there's a lot of money matters. Like, I feel like right now what is important for you, Sagittarius, is have a name for yourself or your build a niche for yourself or have that much money. Like, you're me, you, you have been working really hard, I'm seeing, and... Sometimes you think, Sagittarius, you've been working really hard and you're doing everything that needs to be done. You have everything, but still you're not getting the same output. But what I'm seeing is there's something outside your current location that might that might pay you much more or fulfill your monetary needs. Okay, so you may need to relocate or you may need to find a job that's outside your place. So something on those lines, I feel like somewhere you need to come out of your comfort zone, travel more, you will find a place from where you will definitely get that kind of output, financial output. So if you think you've been working really hard, and you're not being paid off that much, there is this uh, opportunity coming from a different place, maybe in three months from now, that's going to pay you a lot. It will act like a temptation for you. So that is also something that you have to be careful about. Okay. I'm definitely seeing you searching for the best opportunity in career, and you will definitely land um, the best opportunity okay it's like you need to travel more and find yourself more opportunities the depth the arrow wants my gosh four of swords king of pentacles sag what i am seeing right now is some of you have been dealing with a scorpio i feel like uh, sagittarius you're it's over like whatever stress or problems you've been going through you were trapped in it and it's over you're not listening to others you're not listening to people telling you do this or do that you're actually going to 
you know choose something that really makes you click and you know what it is you know deep inside of your intuition tells you this is what i want to do no matter who is telling me what you what you need to do what you don't need to do you're still going to do what you feel you think is right and that matches your vibration so i feel like you're not listening to the drama anymore or you there's a point the point has come where all the drama has ended the struggles are over and this is a transformation transformating phase transformative phase in your life okay you're moving towards major changes in your life everything is rushing towards you in the form of money it's time for you to listen to your intuition and not listen to people telling you do this or do that okay so now it's a time where you will be listening to your own wish okay what you think is right and that is where your actual success will lie you're about to make a lot of uh, money i'm seeing financial growth i'm seeing stability i'm seeing you feeling grounded i'm seeing there is um there is uh, i'm seeing there is more stability and uh, i feel like you guys may also buy a new house if you're planning to do that if you've already reached your point and now you're thinking of planning of buying a new house a big house i'm definitely seeing you doing that um so it's like you are getting the um your wishes are coming to fruition you're getting what you want you're getting that position that leadership position that you're looking for that feeling of being the king or queen of your like like empire you have a whole empire something on those lines i'm sensing you have a pisces around you sagittarius around you any water sign Okay, cancer around you. Sag, what I am seeing is you're about to be in a relationship. Okay, after a long haul, I'm seeing there's a beautiful connection that you will develop with your soulmate. Okay, after a series of uh, you know heartaches or disappointments or ending relationships with the wrong kind of people, deceptive people. you have found a place for yourself in your profession in your career and you're living stable you're very stable you're very happy you're grounded and that's when you guys are open to receive this new energy in your life this new love your soulmate in your life so definitely have soulmate around you which i feel you might meet in around 4 months from now or the relationship that you're having with someone is going to get so much stronger between you and them because your money is growing okay you will have a financial growth like there's a boom in your money that's about to happen honeymoon You guys are going to date now. This is someone new, completely new. You're done with the past, you're done with the drama. And now you're starting a fresh with this person coming into your life. This person is totally trustworthy, not the one like before you've been dating. And you guys will definitely spend long, long, long time together outside, moving from here to there, you know, places, traveling. balance you guys balance each other there's a lot of balance that they bring in your life oh this came out great for oh my gosh there's financial breakthrough coming into your life and some of you are 26 here need not be but you feel young all over again because you have everything that's what you feel gift bad health some of you are into medical field some of you are doctors okay or you may have you may see your patient giving you an expensive gift or you will get something like from someone as a blessing okay so an expensive gift maybe such community you doing something that involves helping others helping people you may be a healer but i'm definitely seeing a lot of money coming in the more you will be helping people the more they will rely on you and come towards you okay as you will be a need of many people that's what i'm saying sag 
breathe, relax. If things are just going round and round, for some of you Sagittarius, you're like, you, you're trying and you're landing on the same page. You're trying and then you're landing. Relax. The universe is asking you to wait and relax. Just take a deep breath. Everything is going to sort out. It's just an experience that you're uh, taking with, your, with you. But eventually, you're going to break away from that cycle and find that place where you will feel like you've achieved your actual goal okay you've achieved your ambition emotion so right now you might be feeling too emotional and it's more about your career i feel right now or there's something from the past in your love life that has been like a series of breakups or series of disappointments and deception and that makes you sad. But eventually I feel like you're literally breaking free from that. For some of you, I'm seeing your partner may be very well off. Healer. So you guys may heal others or you guys may heal yourself very well. You will be able, some of you have difficulty speaking your heart out and you guys, I feel like going to heal your throat chakra. So you may need a lapis lazuli, you can get it from me as well, charged with intentions. Some of you find it difficult to get closer to your partner because of your past experiences, but now you will be able to express yourself more clearly in love and that's how your connection will heal strongly between you and your person Sag, please creative it's time for you to put your best skills forward in your work whatever you're doing use your creative skills i feel like you want to do something that's creative that's something that's related to painting okay or any like makeup stuff like that i'm definitely seeing you um being uh, successful in this field in this venture solar plexus have confidence and do what you always wanted to do you know deep inside what clicks well for you it's time for you to show the world that this is, this is who you are and this is what you want to do and doesn't matter how people judge you and see you you will be strong then i see your intuition is just just what i said you've been listening to a lot of other people's opinion it's time for you to listen to your own opinion what makes you click what makes you happy? It's time for you to detox yourself from the past or from the experiences that have made you uh, feeling stuck somewhere. Your soulmate is definitely right around the corner. I feel they're going to give you a gift. Maybe this is some of you. It's, it's like a doctor patient relationship for some of you. It's like a healer and a mentee mentor mentee relationship. Some of you, it's like a business partner, okay? But I feel like someone giving you an expensive gift, taking you out on a date. Something on those lines is also what I'm seeing. And then we have, I can't stop thinking about you. So your person will be such that once you're in their life, they'll be obsessing over you like anything. You will be their ultimate want, need, wish. Let's see the signs coming for you. We have Taurus. We have Aquarius, we have Gemini. Okay, these are some signs that you are coming across. And then let's see some charts. Okay. I'm seeing uh, someone secretly watching you. And daffodils, some of you have strong passion for daffodils. Something on those lines. Someone has this name. D-A-F-O-N. Has these letters in their name. Okay. Fatness. Something like that. Dino. Adam. Adamant. Someone is adamant. I don't know. That, that doesn't make sense though. But fan. Someone might be a celebrity. Your person is very well respected wherever they're working i feel like you don't know them yet okay but um definitely seeing you meeting them soon you guys may first be partners in work and then become lovers or you guys will work together in collaboration i'm seeing you guys will become so dependent on each other that you guys just can't you know be away from each other it's like you don't know something that's hidden from you the universe wants 
you to wants to surprise you with this gift nanny i'm hearing something to do with nanny no so these are some messages you might link uh, yourself now let's see from aries to pisces what does your person feel about you sag Aries is like bringing in a love offer, have a huge crush on you. The Taurus is right now not sure whether you're interested. They don't feel themselves as fit for you. The Gemini is passionate to take you out on a date. And then we have Cancers trying to uh, hook up. Like, I feel like not hook up really, but they want to have you by hook up, by crook. And then we have uh, Leos. This, this is making a decision. This person's making a decision regarding you. They're not sure. They have options. Virgo wants to give you a love offer. I feel like the Virgo is very caring and loving. The Libra is totally obsessed with your personality. Has been thinking about you. Scorpio wants equal give and take. True love. This is like they want to be there for you. They want equal give, uh, equal respect for each other. Sag is kind of playing hard to get. Manipulative. Or oh, this is you that's doing this with someone. I don't think that could be you. But if it's another Sag. Then we have uh, Capricorns, like kind of spying on you, I feel. And is talking behind you, about you. Then we have Aquarius, wants to take it forward towards deep commitment and strong love. Marriage, probably. Pisces is just smitten by the way you look and how you carry yourself. They want to be you. <laughs> I'm definitely seeing them so fond of you they think you're special and they want to treat you special so yeah that's about it i hope you've enjoyed it such and don't forget to like subscribe and comment down below let me know how this resonated don't forget to subscribe guys and do like this okay bye